Greetings and salutations, my friends. Welcome back to another edition of Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. Ah, yes. Unfortunately, yesterday we had to cancel the stream, so we are back this morning. I think we might do both morning and afternoon streams of KOTOR. We'll just have to see how that rolls. But we're going to jump right back in where we left off. Unfortunately, <clears throat> I left it running after I stopped my stream the other day, so... The timing's a little off. It's got about three extra hours on it. Because KOTOR uses so little computer power that it doesn't really register. You don't even notice. I was editing video and everything, and it was just running in the background. And what I'm doing right now is I think I want to mix it up here. We've had Karth in our group for a very long time. And I think we're gonna we're gonna swap him out for a little for the furball. For the furball we have not yet grouped with zanzibar at all and i have not got to make fun of his name and i'm here we get to level him up yay okay here we go and uh so he is a scout so he's not actually uh, uh the warrior class but he has so much hp he just has so little defense it's not even funny so we're gonna have to augment that maybe one of these days and he has demo as a class skill holy crap based on intelligence which he doesn't have much of he has repair awareness and yeah we definitely want him to get treat injury definitely want him to have treat injury i'm not gonna care about awareness and i have repair so feats he gets uncanny dodge i don't know if i really want to do the dual weapon fighting i definitely want to get anything that increases his defense so we're gonna get him uh we're gonna get him that um toughness there Wait, there we go. Yes, yes. And we're going to level up again. And I think we're going to give him another dex. That'll add another um, another plus to his armor. Uh, plus one to his armor. Yeah, so now he's 12 defense. <laughs> he's basically just going to get smacked on the entire playthrough. But that's okay. Zanzibar deserves it. And I think, uh, do we want to save that or do we going to put it in awareness? Uh, we're going to put it in awareness. Might as well, right? Is repair a class skill? I mean, he can't even, technically he can't even use repair, can he? Because fixed disabled mechanical devices like droids, that, that's all the player character. And if you repair a droid, that's their own repair skill, right? So, yeah, construction kits, yeah, no. No, we're not going to worry about that. And he got implant level 3, hell yeah. And I think this will be the last level we're going to be giving him. Let's go ahead and give him more demolitions, treat injury, and awareness. We'll give him... I think we're gonna get him, give him two weapon fighting. He's got an, he's got fair amount of HP. I want him to have both of those weapons because they're ridiculous. They're ridiculous. Let's go back. I don't think we added that. There we go. Now we added it. Yeah, there it is. Level nine. I'm level ten. She's level nine. Excellent. All right. So now he has twelve defense. Oh, goodness, goodness gracious. Uh, we're gonna give him a few shields. Yeah, give him Bredgic's armband and strength amplifier. Yes. Yes. And the prototype vibra blade. So he's not going to have near as much attack as uh, as as uh, Karth did. However, he has a lot of strength. So, I mean, we'll see how it works. We'll, we're going to see how it works. And maybe we'll give him another constitution. Neither one seems to work for him, huh? Because he's got... 21 plus 5 constitution with the cardio package. Hmm. I think we'll just go ahead and give him the dex, maybe. Yes? I'm here. Mm, sure. Maybe. I think we'll keep the dex one on him. What do we what do we got on our guy? Cardio package? Yeah, because it gives us 12 plus 1. Everybody's light side but me, man. Look at that. Look at that. Arr. I forgot you could spin your character. It's so so old school. Right click, left click, right click, left click. That's great. That's great. All right, now, he's probably not going to do too well, but I want to see how well he actually does. He's only got 12 defense, so we'll see. How much HP does he have? 144. So, actually, Karth wasn't too far behind him, so we'll see how he rolls. We'll see how he rolls. He should uh, destroy sure. destroy them. Destroy them all. And uh, we won't have Karth interjecting and helping uh, helping Bastilla. She can, she can be annoying as shit all on her own. So I think we're going to go ahead and save that. Yes, indeed. More loot? No. No more loot. No more loot. So we need to go to the Sandro Grounds. Is that where we're heading next? I believe it is so. But let's just head over to the Grove. I don't think we went over there. Ah, yes. The sound. Womp, womp. Womp, womp. 
And is there nothing else over here? We just leave it be. There's a Mandalorian. No more loot. No more loot. Come on. I, I must have forgotten something. Like, where'd her body go? Did it get eaten by cath hounds? By the way, Juhani is an actual character. You can get in this game. Whoa. Funnily enough. And we killed her. Yay! Yeah, unfortunately, you actually have to pass that... That You actually have, have to pass a persuasion check to be able to keep her. And I did not, for some freaking reason. Even though I have pretty good charisma. Pretty good. Pretty good. 14 plus 2. It's not bad. Not bad at all. Now, let's see how well our walking carpet does. Funnily enough, we may end up having to go back to uh, what's his I'm face. Here. Of course, if all else fails, I may just go to Candorous. Because he still makes a decent tank. He just doesn't... Uh, he doesn't have two weapon fighting. All right, let's not do that. Let's do this. There we go. Yes. Yes. Are you, are you, are you guys not going to attack? I'm going to fight him on my own. There we go. Get him, Zanzibar. Get him, boy. Sick him. And, god damn it, I can't, I can't move. No. All right, I think we got some more stuff in the cave, so I think we're going to go do that. I'm still like blown away by how much defense he has. It just the utter utter insanity of his strength. He's got 21 plus 7 strength. So next level, when I give him when I give him uh, the next two weapon fighting, it's going to be ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. And the other toughness would only give him nine more HP, right? Right? I'm pretty sure. It's only nine more. Yeah. And okay, so none of this respawns. Oh, I was hoping for more crystals. Damn it, man. Damn it. So I guess uh, I guess the rest of it's just the th just the the sand roll stuff. Nah, that's disappointing. I am so disappointed. That's okay. I must have been thinking of the second one of uh, Knights of the Old Republic too. Don't you worry, we'll be playing that right after this, too. So, still, I'm still unsure as to what we'll be playing right after uh, They Are Billions. We'll, we'll have to see. I'm definitely going to be playing the survival mode of They Are Billions. Uh, they, have two new, ooh, they have two new maps on the survival mode. Uh, do we want to do Flurry? I don't think so. I mean, it did give him three attacks. So, apparently... His attack is high enough. So what's my attack's 14 and hers is 10 and 12? I mean, is that doesn't seem it doesn't seem necessarily high. I mean, it works. It works. I think Karst was like 16. Sure. And of course, <laughs> the person I'm controlling is the one that breaks. And where's the map? The map. Okay, we gotta go this way. And we shall hopefully not crash the game. There we go. For a second, I couldn't freaking move, man. Sometimes, dude. Sometimes. It's like grr. Arg. Grr. Arg. And I think this is... Uh, we've already looted this. Yes, we have. And that. Yes, we have. And the Foot Locker. No new loot. Bam. Well, at least we didn't miss anything, right? I love lightsabers. So much. Even though I'm a caster. Oh, hello. Hello, animal thingy. Attack! I say attack! There it is. Ooh, 12. Did you see that? Did you see that? There we go. Did he power attack? That's awesome. Zanzibar with the power attacks, man. Hmm. I was almost thinking of getting uh, Candorous and having me and Bastila, but I don't know if that's going to work if I make him use the uh, the blaster. I do not actually believe there... You know, in, the, in at the very beginning of the game, it says you can't use blasters in melee combat, but it never says why. And I don't see anything in any of the tooltips that says that using blasters in close quarters will give you any negative modifiers other than it's bad because they're using what you call it now in normal D&D &D, they do 
give you a warning where it says if you like that that's why there's a feat called close range fighting and that feat allows you to use ranged weapons in melee range so that you don't suffer a penalty because normally you suffer like a was it like a negative four attack penalty and the attacker gets like a plus one or plus two to attack when you're using a ranged weapon in melee combat all right here we are this is private property by what authority are you trespassing on this estate? Sir, I have come on behalf of the Jedi Council. The Council? If you are here because of Shen Matali's disappearance, you are wasting your time. The Sandals are not involved. This is nothing but a Matali witch hunt. You're a snappy frickin' droid, aren't you? I am not in league with the Matales, but I must speak to Nurek. Nurek left orders he was not to be disturbed, but given the circumstances, I will make an exception. Go into the main hall. Nurek will meet with you there. Very well, Mr. Droid. Alright, let's save it. You know, as, 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 as ridiculous as they made the droid, you know, droids or slaves thing in the new Han Solo movie... I am I am on the side of you should not mistreat droids. I dislike it when people mistreat droids in the Star Wars movies. I really do. Droids are people too, man. Droids are people too. Uh, I know I'm I'm a freaking hippie. No. Damn it. All right, here we go. We're going to Greetings and salutations. We are back. So we had to edit out some uh, technical difficulties we had there, and hopefully this time we don't uh, crash. Here we go. It must have been the extra saving. It must have been what it is. Come on, fingers crossed. Yes! I have been informed by my protocol droid that you wish to speak to me. Hmm... I want to ask you about the disappearance of Shin Matale. I feel great sorrow at the young Matale's disappearance, but they are not the only family to suffer such a tragedy. Dantooine is a dangerous place. My own son, Cassus, has been missing for some time now. But I know nothing about the disappearance of Shen. Perhaps he and Cassus now share a similar fate. The Jedi Council have instructed me to investigate this matter. May I search your estate, sir? I brought my family here to find peace and safety, not to be harassed and treated like common criminals. Your council has no authority here, and I respectfully ask you to leave this property at once. Jedi are renowned for their fairness in pursuit of justice. There is nothing to fear from us. Unless you have something to hide. I trust you will show yourself out. If not, my security droids will be sure to deal with you. I see. I see. Hmm. You are here from the council, are you not? Looking for Shen Metale? Yes, indeed. I probably should have told him about his son. Uh, hmm. I just came to tell you that Nurik, uh, tell Nur tell your Nurik about his son, Cassius. My name is Rahasia. Nurik is my father. He has not been himself since Cassius disappeared. He is mad with grief, and he is convinced the Metales are responsible. He's not thinking rationally. Um, but to your point, uh, Ryan, I agree. You shouldn't worry about others. But the problem is, is that we're humans, which means we're apes, which are communal animals, and so we naturally gauge ourselves based on what others are doing, just because that's that's how we function as a social animal. And so, it, even even though you should focus on yourself and like you're doing good, so you shouldn't worry about what happens to others. It that, unfortunately it just doesn't work that way. You always feel it, no matter what, unless you're so high above everybody else that it really just doesn't matter, right? And so many people cheat in this comp sci curriculum, it catches up with you. I could totally see that. I, I, it probably happens the same in the nuclear community, i got to imagine. But the uh, filter that the Navy puts in is pretty hardcore. So if you don't know it, yeah, you're just not going to be able to do it. All right, does this have anything to do with what happened to Shin? Cassius was killed by cath hounds. The Matales had nothing to do with it. Cassius is dead? It is as I feared. Though I'm relieved the Matales are not responsible. My father is a good man. When my mother died, he raised me and my brother by himself. He loves his children, and we love him. I just don't want you to judge him too harshly. Hmm. I only want to find Shin Matale. Judge him. 
Wait, what did your father do? You must understand that father has been under a terrible strain. I have no wish to disobey him, but there are matters where even my father's authority is not absolute. Oh, wow. Please, tell me what has happened. My father has kidnapped Shen Matale. Uh-oh. He is holding him prisoner here in the compound. He feels this is a way to get back at the Matales, a way to get even for the disappearance of my brother Cassus. Uh-oh. Oh, I see. Well, there is the answer we seek. The Jedi Council should be informed of this at once. No. Since Cassus went missing, my mm. father has become unstable. He might hurt him if you do that. He no longer even cares if the Matales are responsible for what happened to Cassus. Oh, I'm God. afraid my father will simply kill Shen out of a mad, misguided lust for vengeance. Well, I mean, he may be mad and he may misguided, but vengeance is always good, right? Uh, why are you telling me all this? Shen is an innocent victim in all this. My father is not a bad man, but his grief has driven him to madness. He must be stopped. Please, find Shen and rescue him before my father does something he will regret forever. I would take you to the prison, but I cannot let my father see me with you. Take this key. It will open an unguarded door at the rear of the estate. You and Shen can make your escape through there. There are many security droids guarding the halls. Please hurry. You are Shen's only hope. <laughs> you are Shen's only hope. Where do I know that from? Uh, what is the problem between your families? Actually, hang on. Let me let me go ahead and do this. So, my my friend, uh, the thing about anxiety is, is just taking it baby steps, man. Expose yourself little by little to the thing that makes you anxious. And over time, it won't make you less anxious, but you will become more brave and you will be able to deal with it. Uh, and you will become stronger and more brave and be able to deal with it better, if you know what I mean. And uh, your friend got a... 77 in Cal 3? Ooh, man. And your uni would be a B. Why? Because they curve so hard? And what is the problem between your families? Alan Matale and my father have had problems ever since they settled on this world. To hear my father tell it, Alan is a brute and a bully, but a uh -huh. rich one. He feels his credits give him the right to step all over normal people. My father stands up to Alan because no one else will. But now he thinks Alan has taken my brother Cassus and has imprisoned Shen as revenge. Uh -oh. Please find Shen and free him. You are my only hope. Oh, yay. Yay, I'm your only hope. Well, you're screwed, man. You're totally screwed. All right, we're going to hard save it just in case it does some more craziness. Uh, let's see. Uh, we're going to say we're going to make a Zanzibar. Yeah, let's make another Zanzibar. Let's just uh, new slot. Save. Zanzibar. There we go. I love you, Zanzibar. Um, I think we have to leave and go at the side entrance. Yes. Oh, it's scaled from the start because you don't go to a top tier university. See, that's the thing. It's like I understand what you're saying there, and it's it, it, it's not anything to do with you. But I have a problem that that quote non top tier university or that non quote top tier in quote universities don't hold a higher standard than they do. It's and they should and they used to. That's the thing. Is they really used to. But the the money. Oh God. Okay, combat. Uh. Why did you tell me I was still using a blaster? Damn it, chat. Uh, which one is mine? Is this is this one? Nope. Nope. That one. That one's mine. There we go. There it is. Okay, we're good. We're good. And actually, I think Bastila has stun droid. Yes, he, yes, she does. Do I have disabled droid? Do not believe I do. No, I only have shock. Boom! Blow you up. That does quite a bit of damage to him, though. Womp womp. Womp womp. Yes. All right, yes. now Zanzibar. Give me that mine, bro. Can I have that mine? That's mine. That's my mine. Mine, 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 mine. I'm using a blaster. Thanks, bro. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. <clears throat> sure. What can I do? Okay. Uh, yes. Ooh, security room. They pass people who don't do shit on everything. That's what I'm getting at, man. It's um, it's become a pump because of the guaranteed money, and that that just comes in. Okay, so we got two droids so we're gonna run forward and attack you one of the main reasons I'm using regular attack with Zanzibar is because see what's it improved power attack still lowers your what is power attack power attack does not lower your defense but flurry does yes it gives you negative four to defense so if anything we want to use power attack over everything over even even if we are only going to uh do the one. Okay, can I can I shoot this guy? Hey, hey, lightning! Do you like lightning? I like lightning. Boom! Did you see that blaster deflection? Hit him right in the face. 
<laughs> yeah, they just farm money. Yeah, that's it, man. That's it. That's why university is not the um, the uh, deal it used to be, man. Even when I was going in, it felt like that. When I was in high school, I went to a magnet school, right? Where you're supposed to like have academic standards, and they barely they barely failed people out. You know, uh, my best friend. Uh, who will go? Who will remain nameless uh, for posterity's sake? Ooh, mm, do I want to do this? Uh, I don't think so. How many computer spikes do I have? Fourteen. Ah, yeah. We'll we'll view. We'll look at the cameras. Okay. Uh, corrupt patrol droid. Nah, I will not do that. Uh, let's go back to the override menu. South hallway. Okay, got a droid there. No, nah, we're not gonna. We're not gonna corrupt him. But anyway, he uh, he failed most of the most of the way through high school at a magnet school, and they still didn't they still didn't do anything about it. And to be fair, the, I mean they were gonna they were gonna not let him pass and get his degree, but they never kicked him out over having bad grades, which is exactly what they were supposed to do. But they never did. In fact, the dude probably wouldn't have passed high school if it weren't for me. But that's neither here nor there. If the professor fails one student, the dean gets triggered. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about, dude. It's 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 ridiculous, man. Um, and they talk about uh, wanting to give um, have everybody to be able to go to university. You know what I'm saying? And make it free for everybody. And it's like, okay, well, if we do that, what we're definitely do? gonna have to put in a filter, just like they do in places where they have something like like France. In France, it's hard <laughs> AF to get into university. Why? Because it's free. So you have to have stellar grades, man. It's like it's basically like getting into one of the military academies. You got to have stellar grades, and when you get into the academy or when you get into the university, you, if you don't like put in some serious effort, they will fail you and kick you out. No questions asked. And I did not know that. You know, I thought they were, you know, the Lily Frog Men. And it's like, no, no, that's just a, that's just a meme. That's just a meme. It's a funny meme. It's hilarious to be in, to, in fact. But uh, it's just a meme. And don't let it fool you. Don't ever let it fool you. If college are free, the graduation rate. Yeah, probably. Mm. Probably. Mm. Oh, we found him. Okay, well, um... Well, damn. It's like, I kind of I kinda want to keep going. Do, do, we just, do we just ignore the fact that we found him? Do I... Do, what? Let's just save it. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a bit confused. I thought he was much further in. Who are you? What do you want with me? Are you working for my father? Uh, no. I'm here to rescue you. No. Do you, anybody tell you ask too many questions? Sit down and shut up. As you wish. I have no quarrel with wow, you. Wow, it worked. Who are you? All right, well. Rescue me. No, I won't leave. It's too dangerous. It's too dangerous. I'll protect you, bro. Let's go. It's not my own safety I'm concerned about. I'm worried about the fate of Nurik's daughter, Rahasia. She's been trying to convince her father to release me ever since I was captured. If I escape, Nurik will think Rahasia is to blame. Nurik is insane with grief over the loss of his son, Cassus. If I leave with you, it is Rahasia who will suffer. I cannot allow that. Oh, God. The greatest Dane has revealed himself. You don't think no students left behind is a good thing? I... That's true. That's true. Danish, what's up, buddy? Let me uh, let me go ahead and let's do. I'm gonna go ahead and do my thing here real quick. Let's do this. You're gonna see my desktop. I'm sorry, but I had to, I had to start that. I had to start that. Okay, here we go. Now, how can I get you to come with me? Hmm. See, I have this mission, bro. I have this mission that I'm trying to do, and you're like totally in my way. If you don't come with me, I'll drag you out. No, 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 no. Yeah, that's what I'm going to say. If you do that, I'll scream my head off and alert all the guards in the house. The only chance you have is to talk Rahasia into leaving. If you can convince Rahasia to escape with us, I will accompany you. Though I do not know if she'd be willing to turn her back on her home and family. Who could imagine a Sandral doing such a thing for the sake of a Matali? But if she will not go, then I too shall stay. I would rather face my own death than have her face her father's wrath because I escaped. It's almost like Romeo and Juliet. <gasps> Uh, why do your families hate each other so much? My father thinks the Sandals are thieves and liars who followed him here to Dantooine just to steal what he's earned for himself. <laughs> My father is an egotist and can be violent at times, but I think he still cares for me. 
Rahasia's father seems to be falling into the same pattern as mine. They're both too unreasonable to be talked to about the other. I think the only hope Rahasia and I will ever have is if we can escape both of them. Please, find Rahasia and speak to her. Get her to flee this place with me. Oh yes. We're gonna see if my persuasion checks are up to par. You're, you're gonna find out. Oh boy, and if it is, oh man, it's gonna be a great time. Uh, the we, uh, <clears throat> is it light or dark? Well, um, I mean, it's a bit red, if you ask me. It's a bit, it's a bit red in here. I think, I think it's a bit red. I'm here. I think so. I think so. So, Danish, what's up, buddy? How are you doing today? I'm doing great. We had some serious technical difficulties here earlier, but we're good. We're doing good. Yeah, it, I wasn't online because it was, uh, we were having difficulties. I had to. Okay, that's the main courtyard, right? Okay, so we're going to go this way. Yeah, the game, uh, crashed when I entered this building, and, uh, it wouldn't come in back into widescreen for, like, 50 tries, so... Oh, hey, it's a droid. Hi. 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 Okay. Uh, I actually haven't tried this yet, so we're gonna, we're gonna do it. Zanzibar, damn it, boy. What are you doing? Okay, disable droid. Oh, it hit both of them! Oh, it's AoE? Hell yeah, dude. Where is that? Let me look at that power. We need to look at that power. Five meters. Oh, my. Oh, my. I need that power. I definitely need that power. Look at that. They can't even move. Ha, 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 ha. That's great. <gasps> okay. Whew. For a second, I thought I was like, oh, no. And here she is. Um, okay. Can we not talk to her? Is she glitching out? I think she's glitching out. We might even we, we might have to reload this. We're just going to keep going. We'll, we'll let it. We'll let it happen. We'll let it happen. Uh, security control room. Okay, we'll go in there in just a second. Yes. Uh, let's get Bastila to go this way so that we can get everybody to frickin' move. Nom, nom, nom. Yeah, stabby, stabby. Um, I will say this, Ryan. I'm not sure if I like the uh, no person left behind thing because yes. the problem is is that um, you you have to have standards to for, for a level of something. And it's like if you can't meet those standards, that, that's fine. What are you doing here? Here we go. Have you found Shen yet? Here we go. And if you can't meet those level that those levels, that's fine. You know, you can always go do something else. But it's um, but if you don't have those, it's like um, it's like this: when you're running a nuclear reactor, you don't want somebody to be pumped through a program, right? Something so dangerous, something so important, you don't want them to be pumped through a program and them being stupid, incompetent, lazy, and unable to comprehend what they're actually doing. You want at least the minimum level of confidence or competence required. So if you have too much curve, then that's what you get. That's how you get things like quote Chernobyl. Of course, that was that was a whole other level of ball game with that stuff. That has nothing to do with any of that stuff. So we'll not go there. Um, sending it. You think that we are sending it? Yeah, that's yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. You also have to pass an interview. Fair enough. I'm trying to rescue Shen, but he won't leave without you. Grr. Shen can be so stubborn sometimes. Yes, he can. If one of the security droids sees me wandering the halls, father will get suspicious. I can't risk it. But I know Shen would rather die than leave me here alone to face the wrath of my father. Tell Shen I will meet you outside the gates. I will wait as long as I can, but you must hurry. But you must hurry. Okay. So, um, we're gonna... We're gonna... Ooh, ding! Oh, yeah! I love that noise. <laughs> Love it. I'm going to tell you what. Uh, when Pantheon comes out, I'm totally going to see if I can substitute the level sound they have for the ding. I'm just I'm just letting you know. It's probably going to happen. It's probably going to be a thing. And you know what? We should probably uh, save first. Just in case the game goes wonkiness. These old games, they, they tend to do that. They tend to do that. As evidenced earlier. Aw, I don't get any feats this level? Boo. Boo. We're going to get repair. And powers. Ooh, can I get instant? Oh, ho, ho, I could get this. Um, I could get stun droid. Yay! Oh, I get two powers. Hello. Uh, so I could get this and stun droid. Word. I think we're gonna go ahead. And, I think we're gonna. I think we're gonna grab it. Does it? Does it make this go up anymore? So it still does. Directly in front of the Jedi. Victims suffer, blah, 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 blah. So it's basically the same spell. It's just AoE cone in front of you to 
a max of 10 levels. Yeah, you could do 60 points max with this. Yeah, okay, same will saves. Okay. I think we're going to do that. Uh, I would like to get...